Alright guys, welcome back to another video with Tony's phone collection. Today we're going to be drop testing these two razors. Um, this one still works, but the uh, screen uh, cable is damaged. And this one's fully working, but it's locked. So, um, also this is a original Motorola razor. And this is the aftermarket replacement unit that's probably been refurbished or something. So, let's go ahead. I'm going to start with the uh, generic one. We're going to do the backdrop in three, two. And like I said, we start at head height on flip phones. In three, two, one. Let's go ahead and move that aside. Let's grab the OEM razor. From head height on the back in three, two, one. I did not catch that one on slow motion, guys, so I forgot to push play on it. Looks like the battery in the back came out of the OEM razor. Oh, I got a couple indentions on the back cover. Like I said, this one is in the back cover is in pretty bad shape to begin with, so uh, it looks pretty decent. We got the generic unit over here. See, some of the marks rub away. That was already there before. So we got a couple indentions up here. Nothing bad at all. See, it's still on. This one shut off because the battery came out. Both LCDs are working. Let's go ahead and do the corner drop <coughs> on the generic unit first. In three, two, one. That was a nice corner drop. Let's go ahead and do the OEM unit in three, two, one. All right, let's go ahead and grab this one. Slap the battery back in it. I did put some adhesive underneath both these batteries to kind of hold the batteries in place. And that's why the battery didn't come out of this one. Taking a look at the generic unit. It's doing pretty good. Some indents right here. Not bad at all. The OEM unit. Kind of hit down here on the bottom uh, lip. But it seems to be still doing good. Let's go ahead and do the face down. We're going to start with the generic unit first. In three, two, one. We're ready. Let's go ahead and slide it over here. Put the back back on it. And the OEM one. Don't forget to start slow motion again. Let's go ahead and do it. In three, Two, one. Alrighty. Let's see, did they make it? Okay, they both look like they survived. Cameras didn't crack. This one's still booted up. The back cover broke. The little clips to hold it in, look, it's stuck on the phone now. So it doesn't look like this phone is going to be having a back cover on there anymore. The OEM one didn't crack any of the camera lenses. Still on. Let's see if I can get some shade. I can see still turned on. Both screens are working. Let's go ahead and do the open face down. Let's start with the generic one. Alrighty. In three, two, one. Alrighty, let's see. There's the battery cover. Like I said, the battery cover is just going to keep falling off now. But it's going to do the OEM one. In three, two, one.
Not too bad, I would say. OEM one, still booted up, still turned on. Uh, it definitely took some some nicks up here at the top. Other than that, doing pretty good. The generic one is also booted up just fine. Little uh, nicks on this bottom chin. A couple up here on the top. Nothing too bad, actually. Doing pretty good. Let's go ahead and uh, drop them open on their back like that. This stupid battery cover. All right. In three, two, one. That landed on the back. Here goes the razor, the original. In three, two, one. There's a battery cover for the original one and the generic. It doesn't seem to be shutting very flush anymore, as you can tell. The OEM one. Doing pretty good still. We're going to go ahead and do a, uh, a throw so they land on the face. Let's see if we can crack them that way. Here's the generic one. We're going to spin it so it lands flat. There's that one. It's going to do the uh, OEM one. In three, two, one. I admit the original one didn't go as high as this one did. Cracked the screen. The frame is coming off. Um, just coming apart on the generic one. The throw drop is not going to look good for this one. The original. Still working. The camera lens did kind of crack right there. It might just be a deep scratch. I think it's just a deep scratch. Let's go ahead and move on to the throw drop. Let's go and start with the generic one first. Is it still on? That oh, turned off. Alrighty. Here we go. Get the camera focus in three, two, one. Here goes the faceplate. And you guys already know how these ones do, but we're gonna go and do it again just to make sure. This one's in a lot better shape than the last one I tested, so. Three, two, one. Alrighty, I got Motorola Razor Carnage out here, right here, guys. Here is the generic one. No battery. Faceplate is missing. It's over here. There we go. I'm gonna set this one down. And then we got the Silver Razor, which everything but the. Uh, battery door came off everything I guess except the battery door ooh she cracked LCDs are still working still booted up like a beast guys look at that I'll go ahead and do a uh, a look at after after all these are done drop testing so hope you guys enjoyed the video and stay tuned for the next one